Yeah, how's it going guys? My name is Blessius and welcome back to Destiny 2. Today, we're gonna be looking at a hand cannon that one of the community managers, Damage04, actually mentioned, saying he's been using it in some play tests for the upcoming patch at the end of the month. It's so satisfying to proc Dragonfly, AKA old school Firefly, with the upcoming changes in 1.1.4. And I figured before that patch rolls live, we would use it because I got it masterworked. Ladies and gentlemen, Nature of the Beast. All right, we'll start with my masterwork that I have on this. The one thing that's basically kind of random, um, this basically, this basically just gives it a little bit extra magazine. I'm going to guess that it just gives one extra bullet. It has a precision frame. But it has crosshair and steady hand HCS. Not my favorite sides, but of course we're gonna go with whatever gives us more range. You can go over here for a pennant mag, which I don't know, gives you two extra bullets. I, I'm gonna take my masterwork and roll with accurized rounds for that increased range. And here is Dragonfly. Precision kills creates an elemental damage explosion. The go fast update might arrive at the end of the month, but let's take this boy out and see how it is before the changes. So my version has a dawning shader on it, which I find makes this thing look insanely freaking clean. And, okay, come on. Just show your moves and, okay, I didn't mean for you to show your moves with the suppression nade. I, I wasn't ready for it, to be honest. All right, we're peeking down the sight. Okay. Dude, I'm actually a fan of how this gun recoils out. Like, it's not big. It doesn't go up. It's more like it just, it just kind of taps up. I'm actually... I don't know, like, I, I know I go on rants about um, reskins, but I never really uh, used a weapon that looked like this from Suros. I, I don't think I ever did. I, I think I probably just always used, well, the meta, but I never used a skin like this. So, you know, when this thing's being used, I might actually have a good time with it. And yes, I can have fun with things that look like, I don't, I don't know. Okay, we're going over here. I'm having a hell of a time just hitting people. Come on. Okay, this thing does not have the range that I'm I'm really wanting. If that was the better devils, I feel like I'd be able to hit things more, but that just might be the sights, maybe? I know in Destiny 1, sights really mattered, but in Destiny 2, uh, I'm not really thinking they do besides stat rolls, at least on hand cannons. All right, we're going to be coming up here. I'm sure that there is some, like, aim assist and all that stuff. Okay, come back. Okay, so you're around that bend. Frag out. Okay, we got one guy burning. Hey, okay, the dire promise. One of my favorite weapons in the game. Like, actually, I believe that's like the first hand can I made a video of in Destiny 2. Pretty sure. So I don't mind that that thing is wrecking because that thing is a bit of a beast. And oh my god, almost did not make that. Okay. Yeah, vortex nade right there. I'm not gonna step into that void. Big boy, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Woo, we got it. And the dragonfly proc, not to hit anybody, but it it is satisfying when dragonfly or firefly pops. Like, for real, like, who doesn't like the little explosions that you get? I mean, it's really, I don't know, it's nice. I would love to get a kill with it this game. And I would also like not to be shot. What's the darkest before? I don't remember the darkest before. Is that a trials one? No. To be honest, I... Wait, yeah, there is new Trials weapons. I haven't done Trials in Season 2. Uh, and I know that some people might be mad at me for that decision. At least I got him with a throwing knife, so haha! -ha! But, um... I don't know. I, I... I... I did a bunch of Trials. Um... The first couple of weeks of Destiny, when it first came out. But I never went back into it, really. And I'm getting my butt whooped. So if this is gonna be the future meta... Uh... I'm really excited. If this is the future meta, I'm really excited because it's taking a weapon that I'm not doing too hot with at all. And if it's going to be a little bit of a beast, I I'm all right with it. And look at this guy. He's freaking kudos to this guy. Freaking trying to go and snipe. I get the headshot. Makes the nice dragonfly pop. And n no meme. I, I think it's awesome when people try to snipe because even me, what's on my, what's in my heavy? You saw what was in my heavy. You know I'm cheap. You know I want to get them kills. You know I'm trying out here to snipe. I'm, I don't have Legend of Acarius ready to go. 
Alright, <laughs> just sins of the past. Actually, I'm using classical just for a little bit of some hoorah action. Okay, come on. And I die. Alright, this thing is not really doing, uh, doing me right. And it's kind of feeling bad right now. Anyway, I am honestly, I, the more I think about it, the more excited I am to see how the new update is going to pan out with the Go Fast update. Um, you know, if it's going to make it, you know, Destiny 1 speeds or just like how the changes are in Crucible, let alone how those changes are going to pan out for PvE. Um, I am really excited for it. But right now, I'm not excited about this weapon because I, I know it's not for this patch, but I was misled. But also, that's so cool that, like, if this, if this hand becomes optimal, that might be cool. You know, like, if they're changing the sandbox that much, I'm digging it, man. Like, I've always said, my favorite times in games is when a massive sandbox change hits. Whether it's, like, playing a game where, like, there's classes that get changed, weapons that get tuned. Like, it's fun because you go out and use your whole arsenal to find out what you're having fun with. And there's like that weak period of just like, whoa, what's good? What's good? And it's just a lot of fun. But I will say that this thing is not fun to use currently. All right. So uh, they only need about, you know, 10 kills. Feels good. All right, we're going to go around 10 kills, more like freaking five kills. Hold up. All right, so there's gonna be people in the comments being like bless you just a potato look 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 you give me a good weapon I can do well you give me a, a Poo poo weapon, and I probably won't do well also I can't wait for like the whole team clumping thing to quiet down like that's something that I I'm I can't wait for I can't wait for that as far as this weapon goes I'm gonna keep it, but if that patch wasn't coming I'd probably just throw it in my vault for all of time, don't show me my KD. That was brutal. Also, someone got a 14 KD. Ouch. Ouch. That's ow. Ow. That's ow. Ooh. Ooh. Is this the moment where I uninstall the game out of shame? I'm just like, I, I got my butt wrecked that bad? Like, ouch. Ouch. So, we got an exotic. Why not just open this while we're here? Because, well... I don't think I'm going to take that bad boy out into the freaking crucible and I never got the colony before so huzzah! I'm actually a little bit excited about this. Yes! Yes! I finally got the colony! Yes! I'm actually excited about this! Hell yeah! Hell yeah! You know, I've never even seen what the colony looked like with the name of the colony. I expect it to look like a beehive. I'm legitimately excited about this. Hell yeah! I've got killed by this so many times, and I can't wait to be that guy that uses it as well. Freaking insectoid robot grenades. We finally got it, baby. Yes! Yes, I finally got it. Nice. Nice. Hell to the yeah. I'm excited about that. All right, one one final thing. Let's see what Shax has for us before we go off and say goodbye to Lord Shaxmas Prime. All right, Shax, you're gonna give me a better Devils. All right, and also, if you guys want Nature of the Bees, you can pick it up apparently right now too. So there's your pro tip of the day. And yes, boots, boots. All right, Nature of the Beast. Well, pro tip, you can pick it up right now. And, um, you know, it might be one of those zero to a hero kind of things at the end of the month. I'm, I'm patient to see how it turns out. And I only got two kills in that game. Yikes. Yikes. Woo! 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 Ooh, that's brutal. Anyway, zero to a hero. Maybe? I don't know, but we'll see at the end of the month. Guys, thank you so much for putting up with me, taking your time out of the day, and supporting this channel. Hopefully you enjoyed the content, and if you really enjoy the channel and the content, yesterday we made a video with Super Smash Brothers Melee celebrating the announcement of the Switch version that uh, I seriously cannot wait for. So if you want to see that, it's in the iCard, and also it's down in the description. Thank you guys so much for all the love, and until next time, Kawabunga!